Zero reporting in. what's up? I want to have a little bit of talk about Black Ops 4 because honestly, this game is very annoying. It's frustrating. I'm pretty sure a lot of people out there can really agree with what I got to say about this game. It's a very frustrating game. Air, pretty much about everybody knows it. There's some people that's not going to go along with it. Some people are going to deny it, but everybody knows this game is annoying, you know, with a hit marker galore. You know, you got the lag compensation. You know, we got all that shit up in this game. 150 health is way too high. I mean, seriously, like, I think 125 would have been a whole lot better. But honestly, 150 is too high because there's been plenty of times I shot someone and their health was stop at like 30, maybe 10, or even possibly 4 health. And now I just get instant melted. There's been plenty of times I shot people in the back. And they, I'm not, I mean, look at this sniper here. Another example why this game's annoying. Just get bleeped. He's gonna bleep me again in a second, just y'all see. But really, like, the hell, the snipers, this game just, it doesn't seem right at all. You just get killed in the weirdest ways. And it makes no sense. How did Treyarch come out with a game like this? I don't know. You literally had to play the cheesiest way pop. I mean, look at this. You barely even saw me, but yeah, he's able to bloop me no problem with a headshot and collateral me with a teammate. <laughs> I mean, seriously, man, the, the specialists are annoying. The snipers are annoying. I mean, there's some goods and bads about this game, but it's definitely more bad than good. I can't really think of much good for this game. I mean, yeah, I mean, there's some decent weapons. I mean, they can definitely use more weapons in this game for sure. I, I'm pretty sure there will be more in the supply stream later on in this game life cycle. I, I honestly don't even know if I'm even going to get another Call of Duty game after this one. It's just way too much of a disappointment to even bother. I mean, look at this sniper. I, I just keep pre-firing him. So he doesn't really try to peek and snipe me. <laughs> I mean, you literally had to cheat this game the best way possible. I mean, the VKM, they use the SG12 with the scrub light. I mean, the SMGs for the most part are useless. Snipers are blue machines. Most of the scores we suck. I mean, this game is just ridiculous. And on top of that, I mean, look at this. <laughs> Aim it down sight. Bloop. I mean, they even added zero into the game, which made the structure even more useless. So really, there's not really much of a reason to run kill streets or score streets. You, you might as well just run around with just your specialist ability and getting kills that way. Because honestly, if somebody's in zero, like I am in this gameplay, all somebody gotta do really is put out a little laptop, and boom, there goes your score streak. Bye bye. You did all that hard work for nothing. And honestly, that's just terrible. I mean, you got LMG, the AKA the Titan, with FJ1 and 2, even with some other weapons, FJ1 and 2, or just FNJ in general. You got launchers, you got zero. I mean, like, come on. Like, Score streaks in this game are the most useless I've ever seen in Call of Duty game. I've never seen score streaks get shut down so quickly and so badly like this game. It's unbelievable. I mean, you already got annoying specialists. I mean, how can this game be the way it is? Like, this game doesn't feel like they spent three years making it. It feel like they spent like one year making trying to scramble a whole bunch of ideas together. That's honestly what this game feels like. It, it does not feel like they put that much effort into this game. It feels like they put a minimal amount of effort for maximum profit. Honestly, that's exactly what it feels like. Minimum effort for maximum profit. I mean, I really wanted to give this game a chance, try to enjoy it, but it's really hard to. Multiplayer, just a, it's just a complete mess. I mean, it might, this might well be no multiplayer whatsoever. It's that big of a mess. There's no campaign.
campaign. I mean, after Black Ops 3, I mean, obviously, it probably wasn't going to be no campaign because Black Ops 3 store was a mess also in the cell. Uh, I mean, there's the zombies. It's always crashing, lagging out, migrating hoes. I mean, like, I can't even enjoy one game of zombies. And zombies would be the best part for this game since this multiplayer is trash. But since zombies keeps crashing, lagging out, people rage quitting left and right, I mean, it's extremely hard to even enjoy zombies. Blackout is just okay. Nothing particularly that good about it. I mean, it can be okay, but for the most part, it's just alright. Nothing spectacular. I, this, this game is just such a disappointment. I'm pretty sure you can tell by the way I'm talking about this game. It's just heavily disappointing for me. In many videos, I've probably done made about it already. I mean, look how cocky this sniper is. <laughs> it's just it's ridiculous, man. Yeah, I want you to pick up a sniper in real life and tell me you better rush around with that. And the fact that it takes way too long to kill people in this game. It just made it just increased their infuriation of this game. You just take too many bullets. I had to use pretty much the whole magazine to try to kill one person. And then like you just get swarmed by like two, three, or maybe even the whole entire team. Brute force attack running. This game it, it just too infuriating. I'm gonna try to name some good things for this game. The gunplay is very good. I will give this game that. The gameplay is very good. Blackout is just okay. I mean, I think Blackout might be the only thing that was a saving grace for this game. If it were just the multiplayer and just the zombies, this, this game would hit rock bottom already. It would not have lived long at all. This game. It's ridiculous. Even the team bouncing is bad. Team bouncing, skill based matchmaking at its finest. Right here in Black Ops 4, and everybody knows it. And this is pretty much how you guys use the game. Just aim down sight, tighten. I'm, I'm surprised this guy ain't using a thermal. That's pretty good, you can see. Everybody knows how powerful the Titan is. Now, the next cheesy thing I want to talk about for this game that really infuriates me. I'm pretty sure a lot of people too is a specialist. I mean, like Ajax here. He's another specialist that you, well, before he got nerfed, he used his nine bangs and his doom shield, which is straight ripped from Rainbow Six Siege. I'm pretty sure a lot of people know that right now. You really had to cheese this game with specialists. He's one of the prime examples before he got nerfed. Even now, he's still somewhat annoying. I don't know how I didn't kill that person though with a headshot, but whatever. But specials are even the things that adds on to the frustration. Like specials really need to go. They should not return. They're, they're kind of fun to play with in Black Ops 3. Honestly, that was the last time I wanted to see them. I didn't want to see them in this game, but whatever Treyarch, whatever Treyarch wanted to do. Ajax here with his nine bank doom shield, the annoying prophet with his secret drone. Oh, yep, look, there it is. There he is, falling right behind it as always. And anytime you see a soccer secret shock drone, I mean, you just know the prophet guy is just like right behind it every time. Secret shock drone, watch. Either just him or the whole entire team following that thing. You will not know how many times I have seen a whole entire enemy team following a shot drone just for a kill. It is unbelievable. I say the the least annoying specialist. I mean, you know, collateral. Damn. I say the least annoying specialist in this game is recon because they're all right and. Crash. Yeah, those old two stress are not annoying because really they don't really do anything annoying. I don't know how that sniper got me. I'm not even gonna bother looking at that kill cam. But really, 
This guy cheats this game so hard. Like every lobby is an MLG lobby. And how am I not able to kill this guy? Oh, the hit detection lag compensation is real. But really, you got to cheat this game and act like every lobby is an MLG lobby. Multiplayer? Nope, got struggle straight. MLG, just to do good. You know, like, hey, maybe in Black Eye, baby, relax a little bit. Nope, you gotta go MLG in that as well. Oh, what about zombies? Nope, because the zombies are super aggressive. They head straight at you and everything. You can't even do, be relaxing zombies. Like, you gotta go try hard in every single game you play in this game. And that is just ridiculous. Mm, Call of Duty used to be this casual, fun to play shooter that was heavily popular. Nowadays, it's just a pure life. Oh, 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 you go to profit. Where you at, homie? What's up? How is this game supposed to be as popular as like Black Ops 2, Black Ops 1, NW2? Hell, maybe even MW1 or 3. This can't. Mm, look at this. Nine bang. You're done, son. That's literally how you gotta treat this game. You gotta cheese every single gunfight, every single lobby, every single game you play as if your life depends on it. If not, you're just gonna get shit on, you're gonna get frustrated, you're gonna wanna break your screen, you're gonna wanna punch stuff and people. I mean, seriously, I mean, look at this. But yeah, I'm able to melt it right there. Oh, Jesus. Like, I'm probably gonna take a break from this game again. I already took a break from this game like five times already. And, you know, I might upload some Doom or Battlefield Enemy once more detected. or something. I might just step away from this game. And how did this hailstorm hit me, man? He didn't even directly aim for me, but I guess he got lucky. But I probably need to stop ranting about this game. Just let it be. Probably just let the rest of this game gameplay flow because... The more I think about it, the more frustrated I'm getting in. This this game is just infuriating the fuck out of me. It really is. It's just unbelievable how this game launched and how they even produced this kind of a game. They could have done this a whole lot better. I had high hope for Treyarch, but after this, I, I pretty much don't. I just can't wait to see what Infinity War has next. Hopefully it's a Modern Warfare 4 game. Can't really say for sure what it may be. Hopefully it is. But anyway, I'm let the rest of this flow through and who knows, I might do some Battlefield or some Doom. So don't be surprised if you see something a little bit different for a bit. Maybe even some Halo. But yeah, I'll catch y'all next time. And just let me know what y'all think about this game down below in the comment section. Give this a like if you agree or dislike if you don't agree. It doesn't really matter to me at this point. Just let me know what y'all think. And yeah, I'll see you later. See you. Hostile RCXD spotted. Friendly tag deploy beacon offline. There goes my bottom line. Done.